two more events go by where two more gentlemen uh, show down in this. Uh, actually, no, on this one, actually, it's it's a, a woman and a man. This woman who's a pretty tough-looking warrior, probably one of the guards of the Castle Whitestone. Um, she, still partial armor, has been guarding the event, has taken her helmet off to be part of this event, kind of taking a, a moment to be too relaxing. She uh, goes up against looks to be a, another merchant in the town and just destroys him. Yeah! At this table, you can now see uh, uh, Vedmeyer and the woman guard sits down. Um, she, uh, oh, yeah. Someone says like, oh, oh, Trisha's wrestling. Oh, and, yeah. Well, her, name, her name's Trisha. Trisha. Um, Trish the dish. <laughs> Vedmeyer gets down again, the chains <laughs> against the wood as he sits down with a smile, kind of just Gives her a grin and a nod. She's just intensity towards him the whole time. You can see there's there's a little bit of intensity to win, but you also see spite in that look. You see that she know, kind of knows what he's done and means this is this victory means more to her than otherwise. Um, the two of them get to first match. She pushes and gets the upper hand, forcing wow. her the three quarter view perspective. She's uh, tensing herself. You can hear the muscle uh, tensing beneath the uh, the armor itself and the metal creaking as her whole upper torso begins to kind of push into it. Uh, ah, she begins to push it. Back. Yeah, Trish the dish. Trish the dish. Trish the dish. Trish. As you guys are, are are shouting this and keeping it going, she gets pushed back again into a defensive position. Uh. You can see the blood rushing to her face, but he himself is starting to really intense, and he can see there's surprise in his face from the the the, the battle she's giving. Um, she uh, pushes it back up into the center. This back and forth, the crowd's starting to get really intense. And you can see the shouting and the cheering. It's really quiet as everyone's now just kind of breathlessly watching this bout. Um, she pushes him <gasps> back in three quarter position. Um, on, he goes <laughs> Come on, and begins to, to rally his own strength. Uh, but it's not enough as she oh! Oh! onto the table. Uh, as she, as she kind of releases, it goes. Yeah! <sighs> you deserve that, and much more. She gets up and walks away. The yeah! Tanker, <laughs> the tanker is held out for her, and she just kind of pushes it aside and kind of cracks her knuckles as she steps away. The barmaid comes up again and says, you, Champion Grog, sit down. And you, Champion Trisha, sit down. As the final round of this show of majestic might happens now. Hands clasped, please. If I may, thank you for your service to this city. That last round was a true pleasure to watch. Her face goes from hardened and softens for a minute, and she reaches out and clasps you, not hand in hand, but forearm to forearm, and gives you like a solid shake and goes, I've done so little. You've done far more, but we all must do our part to keep the city safe. Aye. But right now, I'm going to have to destroy you. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of love Trish the Dish. As the crowd begins to shout different names, you can see people going, Trish, Trish, Trish. Grog, 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 and the voices are starting to grow and grow as you're both just standing there focusing on each other. Uh, you can see now between her, uh, you know, her, her very, very uh, tightly bunned uh, dark brunette hair, you can see these green eyes piercing through that are looking straight into yours, and there's a little bit of a sly smirk on the side of her face. You can see a little bit of a scar on the outside of her face. It's long time healed, and you can see she's definitely seen her share of battle just from the, the complexion and the intensity in her face. Oh, yes, she is. She's one of us. For the final round, let this show of might Begin! Woo! Strength check. Oh no! Eight. <laughs> As the moment of tension hits, you can sense there's a there's definitely a, a balance. There's a balance. Both of you are keeping it bay. She kind of cocks her head curiously and forces you down. She brings you right down to the edge of the table, and you can see in her face there's this genuine look of surprise. Like she she probably could have finished you. But she feels like there's a trick or there's something to it that she can't be beating you this easy. Oh. You do manage to force her back up. You're still you're still in a bad place, but you've managed to pull out of that circle, and you can see now her intensity hits, and she realizes she's not going to go soft on you at all going forward. You guys keep it. She's still holding you there. You're not able to gain any ground, and she's keep, you're really impressed by this display she's giving you. She oh, forces oh. you back down. You force her back up into a three quarter view. She's she starts like. Really pushing into it, and you can see now the sweat stripping off the front of her brow. Uh, her eyes are kind of quivering. So at this point, you're pushing down, down, and she gives you this look. This is unreal. Of a, yeah, of of, an, of intense anger and push, and then her face softens, and she gives you a nod of respect. Oh! Oh! 
releases the grip and she pulls away. She raises her hand up. Crowd goes wild. Uh, the, the, the drink is slamming in front of her, the, you know, the, the, the ale swishing and spilling over the side. She takes it in one hand and slides it forward and hands it oh, in front of you. Oh, she's a good lady. You are a true warrior, and I hope you will continue to protect this city with that strength. I intend to. She kind of gives you just a nod and walks around, accepts her queen purse, and steps back into the rest of the celebration. I'll walk away <coughs> coughing, <coughs> trying not to cry. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> As you guys are having this conversation, uh, Terry, and you feel a hand kind of hit your shoulder yeah. and kind of turn you back a little bit, and it's uh, Shauna, and she kind of leans forward and goes, Listen, honey, if you're looking to go ahead and find yourself an evening, wait here about 30 minutes, I'll introduce you to someone. And she releases your shoulder and goes back to work. Oh, shit. So as you guys are having this conversation, you notice um, that uh, Shauna is in the process of conversing with a figure at the bar who sat down not too long ago. Um, you only see from the back, but you see a set of armor that is pale guard specific. They have a brief conversation, and the figure turns around and begins to approach the table after glancing over the shoulder a few times towards where you guys are sitting. Um, as you guys are talking from behind Terry, and a, a large figure kind of looms up from behind uh, and smiles as uh, you guys recognize with the uh, brunette hair pulled into a tight bun behind, the kind of healing scar on the face, you see uh, Trisha, one of the pale guard. Yeah! Um, she beat me in arm wrestling. Trish the dish! <laughs> Trish the dish. Yeah. As she walks up and leans and so yeah. kind of kind of leans in and kind of touches the edge of your shoulder, pats you and goes, hey, so, uh, about a long day? Been told you had a long day? Shit. Yes, I have. Can I you lost buy a drink. Uh, just say yes. Say yes. Yes, please. What do you have? Uh, your finest, oldest wine, I guess. Oh. Gotcha, Scotch. All right. She packs in, walks back over to the bar. That was hot. That was hot. Yes, was Damn. Oh. Two glasses <laughs> slammed down on the table in front. Oh, you'll uh, just have Terry a great time. Her. Yeah. She yeah. pours, <laughs> pours a really thick, amber-like liquid into each of these. Ooh. Slams the drink down, pulls her bun out, and her hair kind of curled no, no, no. up and crimped Shit. from being put up, kind of falls around the, the shoulder. Oh. <laughs> Don't puke. Do not puke. Do not puke. Nope. Nope. You're, you're doing great. What's your name? Shanna, we're taking the bottle. They call me Trish. What's your name? TD. Oh. <laughs> well, TD, let's go and have a walk in the moonlight. And she takes oh you by, God. takes you by the arm, and lifts, lifts you out of your chair onto your feet. Oh, she lifted me up. I lift out of your chair onto your feet and goes. I don't. Good to see you guys. Still working out? Well, yeah. I mean, probably couldn't take you. God, no, you couldn't. See you next uh, Winter's Crest, right? All right, have a good night. You're coming with me. And she kind of smacks you on the ass oh, as she pushes you out the room. Tell my story. <laughs> <laughs> you guys watch as Trish, who's a good, a good seven or eight inches taller than Terry, and is kind of just guiding him with one hand in the middle of his center of his back, just pushing him out oh, of the God. tavern. Could we get an oh. insight of if Tarion seemed excited or just terribly scared? Sure. Right. Tarion. Very scared. Not happy, not happy at all. Oh, or I like, mean, interested. Cool. Okay. But scared. <laughs> <laughs>
I feel, uh, wow, that Trish is, uh, whew, she's a lot of woman. Uh, how'd you guys do? Oh, enough about us. <laughs> great meal, great company, yep. great night. Yeah, it was something uh -oh. else. I mean, there's periods that I don't really remember, but um, yeah. she was aggressive when she needed to be and gentle when she needed to be. Terry, you didn't just give each other massages all night, did you? Oh, no. Oh, good. Details. Details. <laughs> I have experienced the pleasures of the flesh. I have now known a woman. And it was outrageous. I didn't really know what I was doing, but she guided me, sometimes by force. Okay. But she was also gentle sometimes. And I, I get it now. I see the appeal. I, I understand women are soft and, and tender and <clears throat> they are not for me. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's so many holes. <laughs> and you don't know which one is the right one. <laughs> and, you know, it and... just depends on the day, I guess. Yeah. That's true. It can be confusing. <laughs> I, I just... Especially in the dark, right? She was so strong, and I was so scared. <laughs> <laughs> and... I really think... <laughs> Without a shadow of a doubt, now you know... Yeah, no, I know. Else. I know for sure, 100 <laughs> percent. I am not gonna do that ever again <laughs> with any any anyone like her or any one similar. Should we like go get tattoos or get you like a new haircut or something to commemorate this? No, my body's a temple and I wouldn't sell it like It's that. a temple. <laughs> did you get to sleep at all or do you need to sleep? When she was finished with me, <laughs> she, <laughs> she let me curl into a ball did you claim sanctuary? Yes, <laughs> Just, there, there, was, there, there was a valley between between her her pecs, her breasts, I guess, and there was a nice little resting place right there that I laid my head for the night. Oh my God. And she draped her arms over me. They were like big sweaty blankets. <laughs> <laughs> and. Uh, I needed to get up to pee in the middle of the night, but I couldn't. <laughs> so I just held it. Mercy, mercy. mercy. <laughs> <sighs> <I'm checking out. laughs> it looks like being attacked by a bear. <laughs> Have you seen The Departed? <laughs> Let's go get cleaned up. As you guys are eating breakfast and, uh, and, um, Cassandra makes her way down and joins you all and begins the meal. Um, her personal bodyguard is looking kind of exhausted and frustrated and tapping the toe. Eventually, you watch as a nude guard come, a new guard comes in and kind of, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. And they switch out, and the, the new personal bodyguard of uh, Cassandra is uh, Trisha, oh. who stops and sets up and apologizes to Cassandra, and then turns and gets new guard and sees all the rest of you eating breakfast staring at her and goes, <coughs> <laughs> Yo. Good morning. Yeah. Good morning. So as you guys now approach and walk in, uh, about 20 minutes later, after this whole conversation, you guys have cleaned up and made your way, and you gather, and she just says nothing else, and it's just now like, a, like oh boy. <laughs> oh, you were just... Oh, what? that's why you're being so quiet. <laughs> oh. 